Scotty, obviously a crunch game for the Bombers and the Bulldogs uh, this Sunday at Eddie Head Stadium. Let's start at the selection table. Dale Morris is probably the, the keynote to take out of that. Obviously a big blow for the Dogs. How do you see that impacting the game? A huge blow for the Bulldogs. I mean, he's been the player over the last 10 or 12 years that's been able to play on a tall, on a small. He's really been able to fix any problem they've had in that back line. He's been a super player. So him going out of the team also with Marcus Adams being a long-term uh, loss for them just means that they're quite a smaller team down back, therefore the opportunity to exploit with quick entries and get it into Hooker, uh, Danaher and also Stewart should give the forward line a good look at a lot of football. The Dogs have won their last two, that's coincided with Jason Johannesson finding a bit, bit more form. What do the Bombers need to do to curtail his influence? Well we talk about the advantage that we've got uh, with the tall forward line but also you've got to look at it, well what are the Dogs advantages in their back half and that elite runs critically important. I think if Fantasia and uh, Tipper can apply really good defensive pressure and uh, stifle that for the Dogs and they're going to have good chances to score on the back of that because they are such an attacking back line. Essendon were excellent around the clearances, the contested ball last week. How do you see that midfield battle unfolding? It's a critical battle. I mean, you, you look at the dogs and uh, they're down in their centre clearance work this year. They've had a, lo a lot of issues with getting their ruckman out on the park. And I think also around the ground, the third man up has affected them. So with Tom Bell Chambers in excellent form, I think that's a real opportunity uh, for the Bombers to get on top in and around the centre, centre clearances, and then control field position from there. Uh, but in saying that, the dogs, their contested ball game has really come back in that last month. Their differential is very strong. So the Bombers will need to be very good around the football to match the dogs in what has been traditionally one of their real strengths over the last two years. Essendon's had a really stable back line over the last couple of months. Uh, the Bulldogs have a bit of an unusual forward line. How do you see the matchups unfolding down there? Yeah, incredibly unpredictable forward line. Uh, on the back of uh, you know so, some personnel challenges they've had. I mean, Cloak has been in and out. Redpath cops a week suspension. Stringer with a hamstring. Uh, we saw six goals from Pickin last week, so he seems the player most likely to kick a bag full. Expect Bont and Pally to roll through a, a bit down there because the need for some tall. Uh, players to play there. Uh, the Bombers will need to get their matchups right because it'll be a different looking forward line that they won't have seen a lot on and it may require Hurley or Hartley to play on a small. Scotty, should be interesting to watch. Thanks a lot for your insights, mate. The ultimate eight-point game.